All right. Now I'm actually on the mic. I love Emma's game face. She just looks so like appalled by everything happening. She's like. <laughs> That's a furrowed brow. Yeah, fuck that. Don't unplug the great guys. If you're listening to this, don't unplug the great USB. Don't do that. It's only for Rumble. Yeah, and some people like using Rumble, you know? Well, if, they, if you like using Rumble, then you should say so. How about you just leave... Some people just leave it unplugged on the side. Like, which what is, the hell? Which is acceptable. No, because plug it in. Not, not very many people use Rumble. A lot of people use Rumble. It's the default. Well, it might be default. Rumble is good. Rumble is tactile. Rumble lets you react to things faster than anything. Does it? H humans react to sight in 15 frames, hearing in 10 frames, and touch even faster than that. Interesting. Touch is the fastest uh, feel. So if you want to know what, if you landed your kill confirm or not, landed your move to land your kill confirm, you can feel the rumble before you can see if you actually landed it. Like, I knew that was a thing, but like... It's also good for SDIing and stuff. And, uh, counting hits on multi-hits so you can parry. Uh, yeah. So you can do it one, two, three, four, five, uh! Yep. Alright, but, uh, we got Marsh versus... I'm not sure who else that is. Uh, Mason. Mason? Mm-hmm. Alright, uh, we got Marsh versus Mason. I, is he gonna go Olimar or Wario? Oh, That's the wow. question. Um, lately he's been going pretty much all Olimar. I see. Wario's still good, though. Wario is still good. Marsh, who do you use Wario for? Swords? Please tell me, please tell me swords. Okay, that's uh, that's still, that's actually like half the cast, actually. Yeah, actually, I'm, I'm in the, I'm a firm believer that Wario beats Inkling. Um, yeah. He, without Roller, Wario doesn't die to this character. Um, he's not, he's, he doesn't mind getting inked up. Roller is beaten by a lot of moves. I think maybe even bite. I, I was just about to ask you how, uh, how Wario beats Roller. Oh, usually bike. usually bike. Usually bike. If you see Roller, you can just bike right through it. Right. Um, or you can just jump over it because you're fast in the air. Yeah. Um, if you get hit with an aerial Roller, who cares? But yeah, and uh, it's actually pretty easy to edgeguard Inkling as Wario. No, uh, no, you just down arrow him. Oh, really? See? See, that's, that's what you gotta watch out for. But even if oh. you get hit with the splash box, you can still make it back if you have bike or waft. Just like we saw right there. Yeah. Marsh making it back with uh, clever use of the bike. Um, uh, we're gonna reset back to neutral here. And you, this looks even, but the oh. Okay. All right. See how? See how? Yeah. He he's a pretty heavy boy. He's a pretty heavy boy. He is. He has the exact same weight as me. Yeah. Ike, Rob, stuff like that. A oh, Ridley. <laughs> Wait, Rario is the same weight as Ridley? Yeah. Wow. That's yeah. I yeah, Ridley is not that heavy, but Wario is for how little and fast he is. And you can see the pressure coming out, and that up smash would have taken it, but unfortunately, a little bit misspaced. Oh, and that uh, falling out the roller right there. Yeah, roller is only good against grounded opponents, and Wario doesn't stay on the ground very long. No, he, he really likes to just, just poke at you with the mirrors. But if you can catch his nair landing, though... That's, yeah. He can give, uh, if you read the cross-up, you're good. You can see why aren't you looking for that up tilt, because that'll basically get him a free 50%. <laughs> <Literally. laughs> He's just up tilt, up tilt, up tilt, up tilt. Right. It's basically all, all Mario's. All I've seen of Wario is... I think I've actually seen... Uh oh, here we go. You know, okay. I played Marsh's Wario once, like, the first week of this game. And then, like, the next time I saw it was, uh, Gluttony vs. Legend. <sighs> Ooh, if he landed that up, up there, it might have been curtains for Inkling. Only 38%. He's got full waft. Oh, I did not notice. <laughs> wow. It's like it's yeah. Yeah, it's, it's pretty. Like, um, it's kind of like where like you notice uh, snake seed four. It's like oh wait, that's there now. There. It's literally <laughs> there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. See, that was the late hit, not the strong hit. So not enough hit stun to get a f combo off of that. But honestly, Mar Wario's so good now, Waft is a bonus. Yeah. <laughs> well, he doesn't even need Waft yeah, he, anymore. I mean, he just... <laughs> he doesn't revolve around the move. Yeah, he doesn't... He's you, really good. He's not a gimmick anymore, it's just it's just a, something you have to watch out for, like Limit. And we see again that splash box coming through, but... Not good enough. Yeah. If he's he might more... have been able to make it back if he just had 
Does it send him like towards the blast zone and not like the, uh, towards the stage? Yeah. But anyways, as Boom. I said before, it is uh, fairly easy for Martian Edge Guard Inkling. Just yeah, just just stick the downer out, and uh, yeah, Inkling, but, Inkling only has... You really just have to do something about it, because while yeah. it's recovery, it is good. It's good, uh, it's fast, it has a hitbox on the bottom, and a hitbox at when you land, but that's it. Uh, but, but that is it, and it yeah. is very linear. Yeah, unless you want to go past the ledge, then that ain't gonna happen. Yeah. So. Uh, you actually have to shield the bike in this game now, because... We had to do it before, but now it'll just straight up kill. Yeah. It used to be a setup move, now it's just a kill move. Yeah. And it still I does good damage. I my like, last stock of game 2 when I played him for the first time. I was like, what do you mean bike kills in this game? Oh yeah. I was like, yeah, bike kills. So does dash attack, as we just saw. Oh, you really went for that. Oh, you really no. went. That trades? Wow. He, you can see Marsh nodding his head like he knew that was going to happen. Whoa. Yeah, right. Like you knew bite trades with up B. I didn't. You. I don't even know how it traded because that move doesn't have that many hitboxes on it. He really, he really bit. Yeah, but yeah, but but Inkling's up B. Because usually you want to trade with something that has constant hitboxes like Mario's, but this one is just like he really timed the bite there with the, with Inkling and the, traded it down there. I'm just gonna say he got lucky right there. Yeah, I wouldn't have done it, but it worked. It got it got him the it got him the game. So here we are. Game number two on FD, decent stage for Wario. I'm not really sure how the stage will work out for either Inkling or Wario, because neither of them really benefit or are impeded by the platforms of both PS2. The only thing Wario really gets off of platforms is uh, free bites because people shield on them. But it's going to be harder to avoid a uh, roller, though. Yeah, that, that is something. But also that, it will be hard to avoid bite. It is, yeah. Uh, Marsh yeah, stopped smashing halfway through. I don't know if there's a delay on this. That's hit by the slap bomb. Wario fully covered right now. Yeah, he looks like like the zombie Wario from Wario Land 3 and 4. He turns I'm purple. Playing, I'm not playing a single Wario game. Well, that's a shame. It, it really is. Marsh doesn't get on the bike again enough. You could just you could just side B again and get back on the bike. It's uh really nice because it's basically Lloyd Rocket sends it across and just ghost ride it. Okay, he's definitely gonna catch that frame trap. Four throw still does good damage, but it's not gonna kill. That was. I wonder if an inkling has ever hit both hits of that up B. You know what? That would just make me mad. I'd be like, really? I I know I only took ten damage, but that just that makes me mad. Yeah, that, that's that's the real tilt right there. It's like you actually just got hit by both. Marsh, uh, but Marsh actually hitting all of his hits of down, uh, down air though. That's gonna take him quick stock. Yeah, he really, well. he really goes out there quick. Like, yeah, he, he, he doesn't even wait for the double jump. No, he's like, I'm just gonna put this out here now. I know this hitbox lasts for almost forever. Um, Inkling's still ahead by a fair margin. Yeah, yeah. We'll have to see, cause Waft is online. Now, does Waft charge between stocks or no? Yeah, Waft charges even when Wario's dead. Okay. So it's like Game & Watch Bucket, kind of? Yeah, sort of. He keeps it, and um, even if even if you're like playing teams, and uh, yeah, that's it. Even if you're playing teams and your Wario has is, is been dead and he shares stocks like a minute and a half later, he'll have Waft. Oh, really? Yeah. Wow. The Wario tech. So a lot of Wario's will opt to uh, stay on the Halo platform and get some free free charge. And if you hit him with a Star KO, that's but you're just basically getting a free walk. Unfortunately, Marsh walking right into that F smash. Like an idiot, if I might say. <laughs> All right, now this is something this is something that always confused me. Does Wario get walk uh, charge from using my right Using or eating? Uh, just using. Like like say you just. They just use bite on Inkling right now. Oh, use bite. Okay, well, in Smash 4, it didn't heal. Oh, well, I knew that, but, like, did it give you walk charge? Only if you ate items. Okay. Bike, uh, metal blade, stuff like that. I don't know, I haven't tested it yet, if eating a person will, ch will charge the waft in this game. Alright, but, uh, Marsh gonna take that 2-0. Uh, yeah, good thing he landed on that waft, or he definitely would have lost. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 
probably would have walked straight into another F smash. Probably. 